Emily, and I am proud to say that I'm genetically unemployable. No, that's not just a blonde joke. It's the truth. I spent my life trying to figure out what my life really meant. And it, I came to the conclusion that it meant I was genetically unemployable because I was no longer willing to work my ass off for your dreams. I have my own dreams, and you all have your own dreams as well. What it does not mean is that those of us that are genetically unemployable, that we're not lazy, we're not poor, most of us, and most of us even aren't happy, unhappy. We're very happy people. Even the poor ones are kind of happy. What you do get to do is develop or discover what life is like and what's left of you after the J-O-B goes away. How many of you have a J-O-B? How many of you love your J-O-B? Because some people do, and that's fantastic. We need you out there. But a lot of us don't like the J-O-B. So I suggest that we go after our passion. Find a way to make a living out of your passion. Discover who you are. Now, I did what most of the rest did. Life is expected. I went to high school, went to college, got a degree, and I landed what I thought was my dream J-O-B. Big engineering company in Houston, Texas. What I call the free fall is when you make that choice to leave the J-O-B and kind of free fall. I moved, it was a Tuesday morning. I walked into my office, or my boss's office, and I said, you know what, I don't want to do this anymore. And he said, when's your last day? I went, you know what, today's good. <laughs> By Saturday, I lived in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And I had a few things I needed to do. I had to take a skills inventory. OK, I live in Albuquerque, didn't look for a job. So I opened the Yellow Pages. And I started calling engineering companies and told them what I could do. Hey, I, I can do civil environmental engineering. Do you need somebody? What do you know? I didn't get to the Bs before I had another J-O-B. So the lessons that I learned in that first free fall was that I can make it with or without a J-O-B. No, I'm not ever going to call it the J-word. It's going to be J-O-B. And I also need to continue to build lateral skills. Well, that lasted for about six years. And my next free fall was to Bozeman, Montana. A lot of you may not even know where that is. I can tell you that it's freaking cold. <laughs> but I still learned a lot. My lateral skills was into network engineering, and so I learned how to be one of, the, one of the two or three people in Bozeman, Montana, that knew how to run a network at the time, and so I made pretty good money. I also learned that nine months of snow and cold bites and moved south again. That's my third free fall, Albuquerque, New Mexico, which brought me to the career that I still have nine years later. And it doesn't really matter what it is, but I can tell you that it's not a J-O-B. What it did do for me is help me create the lifestyle that I dreamed of. And that was finding out that every market has an opportunity. You just have to look for it. I could be a single, stay-at-home mom. I had a, a young son at the time. And make a living, a good living at that. I only had to work three or four days a week. I live part-time on my sailboat. Anybody liking this so far? <laughs> I have the freedom to travel at will. I drove all the way from Albuquerque, New Mexico to be with you guys tonight because I could. Now, every single one of, every single person I mean that comes down this road of the genetically unemployable comes across roadblocks. The difference is we have the passion, the drive, and the ingenuity to go past the roadblock, blow it off, and keep going. So the key is to just start moving. If you don't like your J-O-B, Throw it out the door and start moving. You're not in despair. Keep moving into passionate and engagement. Engage your own life. You have control over it. Passion equals creativity. And if you don't believe me, look at how many internet marketers are out there today. So I guess you can tell what I do now. <laughs> we can take, I can list all afternoon or all evening the different internet marketers that have created products, services, and really fun stuff that any one of us probably use in a given day. What I like the most would be a freedom of expression when you get into passion. Now, all of us have a few things in common, and that is that we love our lives, we believe in life architecture, creating our own lifestyle, and moving forward on our terms, and not working our ass off for someone else's dreams. So I ask you one question. Are you 
genetically unemployable. And if you are, get off your butt and do something about it. Thank you very much. Thank you.